Hey everyone, welcome back to Auto Repair, where we decode car problems one trouble code at a time. Today we're tackling P1350, a code that might seem mysterious but has a clear story once you know what to look for. So what does P1350 mean? This trouble code varies slightly depending on your vehicle's make, but in most cases, especially for GM vehicles, P1350 indicates a problem with the ignition control module, ICM circuit. The ICM works with your car's PCM, that's the powertrain control module, to control ignition timing. If the PCM isn't seeing proper voltage or response from the ICM, it throws the P1350 code. Let's go step by step to figure out what's causing the code and how to fix it. Start by scanning the car with a quality OBD2 scanner to confirm the P1350 code. Don't just rely on a check engine light, get the actual data. If you're having misfires or hard starts, it's likely related. Check for spark at each plug. No spark? That's a clue. Inspect the ignition control module for damage, corrosion or loose connections. Don't forget to check the wiring harness and grounds. Use a multimeter to test for voltage at the ICM. You should see battery voltage with the key on. No voltage. Trace the wiring back and check fuses. If the module is faulty, or if the wiring is damaged, you'll need to replace or repair the affected components. And remember, always use OEM or high-quality aftermarket parts. Once the repair is complete, clear the code with your scanner and take the vehicle for a test drive. If the code doesn't come back, you're good to go. Car Repair Pro Tips Use an OBD2 scanner to read trouble codes before swapping parts. Many issues aren't what they seem. Check forums or YouTube for people with your exact model. Symptoms often point to common fixes. When taking things apart, label wires, bolts, and parts using tape or bags. This avoids the, where did this go? Moment don't over-tighten bolts, especially spark plugs, lug nuts, or anything aluminum. Use a torque wrench and look up specs. Disconnect the battery especially for electrical work. This avoids blown fuses or fried modules. That's it for today's diagnosis of code P1350. If this video helped you out, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more DIY car repair tips. Got questions or a different experience with this code? Drop it in the comments.